shocking video, a patient on a stretcher punched by a paramedic. Now an investigation is underway right now. And that tops our news at 530. Good evening, everybody. I'm Karen Drew. I'm Devin Skillian. A nurse got hold of that video of the incident in center line and immediately took action. Sean Lay live on this story for us. This was a private ambulance company, right, Sean? that does a lot of business, a lot of runs here in the center line area. It's universal out of Sterling Heights. We know tonight that the medic involved with the punch has been terminated by universal, but we've been hearing from a lot of other medics across the area who saw that video and they say the more Narcan is used to save lives, the more people, patients lash out at them. Here is that video shot last Friday on Dale Street in center line and you can see an EMT punch the patient on that gurney. You can also see that this was caught on video. Why? Yelling and screaming, we're told, could be heard, and that is when someone started recording on a phone. From that video, you can hear someone telling 911 that this was a possible overdose situation. The call was for an unresponsive person, and EMTs with private ambulance company Universal out of Sterling Heights arrived to help. If Narcan was used to revive the man, oftentimes when a person is revived, that person can be violent, something Dr. Frank McGeorge faces in the ER often. I've given Narcan to probably thousands of patients, and the thing is, because it reverses the narcotic, some people are immediately thrown into withdrawal and can become both very ill and violent and angry at the same time. First responders sending us this video telling us that no matter how agitated the person may be, EMTs cannot strike the person they are trying to help. Medics tell us on overdose emergencies, the patient is usually strapped to the gurney for the safety of that person and the safety of first responders. Here you can see that man's arms are free and he is flailing his arms and then the EMT throws that punch. Back here live, the medics and other first responders were hearing from about this rather controversial case, say under no circumstances should you ever punch a patient. And again, this uh, EMT with Universal has been let go. However, on the other hand, the first police officer guys that got there says they thought this guy had passed away. It was that critical of a situation, and they know that the crew from Universal did save his life. Police asked if the patient wanted to uh, press charges. Apparently, he said no. We're live in Centerline tonight. Sean Lay, Local 4. As Karen just said, it's crazy that we have to say, or that someone had to say, right. that you can't punch a patient. It's unbelievable. All right, Sean.